guys, it's Ajane, and in today's video, I am giving you guys a quick wig install by the company Miss Lynn's Hair. This hair is banger. I really like it. I did install this wig earlier, so this will not be like a fresh install video, but I did color this wig just to add a little flair to it. So as you guys can see, I did some skunk stripes, and baby, they're cute. They were supposed to be purple, but I didn't uh, bleach the hair blonde before I put my dye on it, so it made it burgundy. But yeah, this hair is super, super pretty, super, super long. This is a 24 inch 13 by 4 frontal, and yeah, she's cute. She's banker. So I'm going to show you guys how long she is. This is how long she is in the front. This is my belly button. My hair stops at my belly button in the front, and then when I turn to the back, my hair stops at my butt crack. So this is how 24 inches look on me. I am 5'4 for reference. I have had other 24 inch wigs, so I can uh, contest that this is um, true to length based off my other wigs that have been 24 inches. So if you wanna see how I installed this wig or if you wanna know more information about this wig, please continue to watch this video. The wig was pretty before it was colored, but I just wanted to do something different with my hair. Um, I like it. So, yeah, if you are new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. And if you are not new, welcome back. I missed you. Like, I really missed you, and I hope you missed me too. Make sure you guys are leaving comments. Comments really help me get my videos on the recommended page. And hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. But, yeah, let's jump into this video. <laughs> So the wig did come in one of these satin bags, which I love. It did come with a wig cap, some lashes, a elastic band, and a beauty blender. I never got a beauty blender in a hair package before, but I'm not mad at it because I do need to be some beauty blenders. So I did go and bleach the knots. I did go back and bleach it again because the knots were pretty thick. And this wig also did not come pre-plucked. I've tried to pluck it a little bit, but um, I did have to go back and pluck it some more to, you know, match my hairline. But yeah, this wig is nice and thick. I think the hair is really pretty. It's more on the darker side. So uh, just, yeah. just be mindful that this hair is like a dark, like a 1B type. It's not like a number two. It's like really dark. Um, I'm just not really used to hair being that dark, but the hair is really pretty. I like it. Inches. It stops right here. 24 inches in. 24 inches okay guys so i've had this wig for about two weeks now and i wanted to revamp it so i'm redoing this whole video so yeah <laughs> what's up guys um <laughs> hey guys so today i woke up and decided that i am going to be dyeing this wig i'm gonna do two skunk stripes here just to make this wig look a little bit more fun. Okay. Let's admire how I looked yesterday, though. I mean, I could see if it was a real nigga. If you lost your hold of T.I., I'd be like, hey, that's T.I. But Usher. <laughs> so I'll put a clip right here. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be taking this wig off my head because my head is so bad when I'm washing my hair, dyeing this wig, and reinstalling it for you guys. I wanted to do this yesterday before I went out yesterday, but she was like, oh, I'm going to be there at 7. And I had just got back in Houston at like 5.30, so couldn't do it. Just had to style this wig how it is. But yeah, this is a 24 inch straight wig. I'm going to get the information. Okay guys, so this wig is by Miss Lynn Hair. It's 24 inches, 13 by four um, inch frontal. And it is like, I think I got like, um, I don't know what density I have, but depending on what density you get, this wig will probably start at about $200. So yeah, 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 yeah. If I have any codes, I'll put it on the screen. But yeah, that is what we're doing. We are reinstalling this wig with some color and I'm really excited to, you know, make this wig look more fun. I didn't do like a proper intro, but if you guys are new, make sure you drop some comments down below. It really gets, it really helps my videos get uh, put out there. But yeah, let me show you what I got for this wig. Okay, guys, so this info was actually inspired by e e Kane on TikTok. Um, she recently did what I'm about to do. This rubber band is stuck in my hair. 
give me a second and i saw that and i was like oh my god that's cute that's fine so this is the color i'm going to be using i picked this berry red i know i said purple well, i don't know if i said purple but i want to do purple but i got this berry red instead i think it'll just be more fun we'll see and i got a 50 and a 30 volume developer i'm not gonna mix it i'm gonna do the 30 volume on my lace because i'm going to re-bleach the knots and 50 volume on the hair okay so i'm going to be trying to get this wig off i don't even think i have any alcohol either guys so hopefully i don't rip off my edges <laughs> But yeah, it's time to revamp this wig. Okay, y'all. Legit, my hair looks a hot mess. But I'm going to show you guys the length of the hair. So this is um, the wig. It's 24 inches, like I said. Um, I don't have my mannequin head. So I'm going to have to like basically freestyle where I want um, <laughs> the color to be. It's already in the middle part, and I'm just gonna do two on the side. So I'm just gonna part it out now, clean the lace, and then do it. So yeah. Okay, guys. So my hair is washed. Here is basically another update on my hair. Here is where she is stopping. So she's growing. I just have shrinkage, you know. But I just cleaned the lace on the wig, so I'm gonna have to blow dry it because I got oh, I got the whole hair wet. I'm gonna have to blow dry it and then dye it. Okay, guys, so here is the braid pattern for this end style. I want to try something different. It's flat, and um, I can like get to my scalp. Guys, right, so the hair is dried and ready. I let it air dry because I don't have a blow dryer. Some gloves. And I just grabbed some foil. And we're using the rest of this B12. Okay, so I, it looks lighter in person, but I left it on for 20 minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and just wash it off because I don't want it to like burn off. Okay, so it took more on the roots than on the ends but the colors still should pick up well. I really just wanted more vibrant at the top anyways. But I'm about to um, shampoo and then condition it. okay guys so as you can see the color took pretty well i did want to go for a more purple but it is definitely giving like a, a burgundy but your girl don't hate it so that's cool i'm gonna come back when this hair is completely done because one of my light bulbs went out in here and i don't have my camera so i can't get the angles right for me to um record and uh do a really good like flawless install so i'm going to come back when the install is completely done tomorrow i start driver's ed so i have to make sure i look really good because it's like a new chapter in my life so i want to look good for it you know like yeah uh i'm gonna come back with the honest review on this wig i only bleached these two corners and i think they turned out really good i'm excited guys Going off on me in the store, and I'm getting embarrassed. I'm like, can you go over your voice? 
Okay, guys, so I look good, <laughs> but you guys can't read the skunk stripe because I have it like laying flat. The only way you'll be able to see it is if I like brush this back, but I don't want to do that right now. I want to do it straight and wear it like this. So, yeah, it's a little frizzy because I've been laying on it. But, y'all, first of all, this hair straightens really, really well. This is a straight wig so obviously it's just straightened well but you know some wigs be capped and this wig is not giving cap um this is a bone straight wig it literally straightens to the bone and look at that down okay let's do like a light a light push yeah it straightens really really well uh, i'm gonna be honest i do have issues with my ends like they kind of maybe my flat iron is too high i fuck my ends i've kind of burnt off my ends a little bit but i with the with the trim or whatever everything else is smooth so with the trim uh it'll get better like i eventually cut it off but this is their 24 inches i think it is definitely true to length it goes all the way to my butt crack and we love butt crack length hair let's see that bounce yeah i like it this hair is really nice this is a 13 by 4 um lace frontal it's not a it's not a lace front so okay so i put a small piece right here uh just for fun and when i put like makeup on it because i got the i got the um lace uh stained but yeah this is the uh final look really of this hair Okay guys, so this is the final look on the hair. I got that boy bone, slickety straight, flat, flat, all of that. Um, the trick is to use a hairspray while you're um, uh, while you're flat ironing it to get rid of the frizz. But yeah, this is the hair, it's super pretty. As you guys can see, it did take the color really well. It did take really well. I did put some makeup on it, but it's like picking up crazy on camera, but I promise you guys, with like, without the light, like without the light, you can barely see it. But like, I promise you guys, without the light, She's fine, but I'll turn that back up. <laughs> so, yeah, this is the final look. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you didn't know what to do, leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more videos of me. Follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok, all at your pink pillow. Um, how do you guys feel about the name change? I changed my Insta my I changed my YouTube name to It's Ajene because I wanted something different. And I just think that that's a better fit for like a YouTube name. But, yeah. I love this hair so much. It's 24 inches. It goes all the way down to my butt. And she's cute. I like her. Let me know what you guys think. Everything in this note will be in my description box down below. She's banger. I love her. And like I just cannot keep I just cannot stop swinging it. Thank you guys so so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Peace. <laughs>